me apaga, se apaga. It's hell in a cell, so we know there are no disqualifications or countouts. You can only walk out of that demonic structure a winner via pinfall or submission. A hell in a cell is one of the most brutal and dangerous matches in the history of WWE. Just look through the annals of history to see what havoc has been wrought in that steel cage enclosure. Well, they call it hell in a cell for a reason. If it was easy, they'd call it picnic in the park or something. But your point is well taken, Byron. Victory must be run inside the ring, and anything not nailed to the ground can be used as a weapon. This is where the dark forces of evil are unleashed. Oh, oh, that'll fillet your chest. Byron, it's impossible to stay one step ahead of your opponent in a match as horrific as Hell in a Cell. Oh, it could come down to the first superstar that can turn that switch and battle on pure instinct because a strategy could be lost, and all you have left is the ability to fight. And that can happen quickly in an environment where cruelty is rewarded for having no bounds. Oh, man. Lesnar moved. Brooks. He's able to come back out of Brock's grip. Just looks nasty. He can pin his opponent right here. He's able to kick out before two. He's not letting fatigue set in or get the better of it. He skirts around it. Oh, vicious knee to the face. For how much longer? Oh, man. T Bar fends that off. I am the counter, bro. Uh oh, this is. Cover, cover! Elevates his shoulder out of the count. Maybe that was just to keep his opponent off balance. Setting it up. Oh, close line. He's in a bad spot. What a close line. Ouch. He has a hold of T-Bar. He's got something in store. Under his clothesline. Brock clearly has the advantage here, guys. Lesnar is calling the shots now. Clothesline. He is just reeling from that offense. This is what Hell in a Cell is all about. You have to be able to endure this kind of punishment if you want the victory. He turns it around on T-Bar. T-Bar fends that off. Saw that one coming. Close line. What impact. Oh, no. Lesnar's about to end this. Five. Bang. Will T-Bar recover? He eludes the contact. Shot to the back of the neck. T-Bar struggling to defend himself. Yeah, somehow T-Bar has to turn the tide. Lesnar with a waist lock. I think we're about to take a trip, gentlemen. This is where Brock Lesnar is at home. Michael Cole takes shelter. Here comes the storm. Brock's got this in hand. Of mind. I thought he was unconscious. 
Lesnar is pissed off now. From the top. The beast didn't cover his arm loose. It is scary how much Lesnar enjoys taking for and he doesn't connect. Well, he's got him here. Oh, Brock put a stop to that. Brock managing to get some control back now. Brock just got tired of being pushed around. He's likely more aggravated now.